Can't you talk to her? Catherine and talking don't really go together. She told me that she cut you out of the will. Yeah, that's because I refused to be her little puppet. See, that's what some rich people do. They try to control others with their money. But you have your own money. Which is why her plan is not working. G-Min, your fiancé is a good bloke. But do you really think he's worth sacrificing your relationship with your mother? I thought he was. But you don't think so anymore? It's possible that G-Man has been lying to me all this time. You know, something Jack said finally sunk in with me. If G-Man is such a brilliant businessman, how could he have not figured all that out? He does have a point. I've just been so wrapped up in this relationship, I've refused to even see it from this perspective. Are you admitting that Grandma might be right? No, I'm not. I mean, I, I don't even know what I'm saying. Jack didn't give me any proof, you know. Well, you need to get some. Look, why don't you go and see the guy, talk to him, stop driving yourself crazy. But the trouble with that is, if G-Min admits it, then I have to live with the fact that he lied and he could do it again. No, but if he denies it, I'm still going to be wondering if he's lying. Either way, the trust has been broken. It's not going to be easy to get it back. I feel like such an idiot for refusing to even consider the possibility he was lying. Mom, if I find out that he's been using you, I promise you, I will make sure he feels the same humiliation that you did. Then I won't have to hire a hitman after all. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no one should have to put up with a liar that makes them question everything they stand for. Darling, are we still talking about G-Men here? There is something that I need to tell you about Amber and me. What is it? She's been lying to me for months. We weren't really married. What? We were in Vegas. We were having a good time. I got really drunk. Next thing you know, I wake up, it's morning. I got a wedding ring on my finger, and there's a marriage certificate, but I just didn't remember anything. And? She faked the wedding. She drugged me. She what? Her Who friend, is this girl? Her friend stood in as the groom, signed the marriage certificate, which Amber oh. then spilled beer on so I couldn't read it. See, I knew she was no good. Baby, I'm so sorry. It's okay. And? She knew I was your son before anyone else because she wanted your money. Well, thank God she's not going to get it. I was a bloody idiot. I'll never forgive myself for falling for her. Don't. Don't you do that. She fooled a lot of people. But I tell you this. From this moment on, no one will ever mess with me or my mom ever again. <laughs>